This is the after uh, winning or losing condition. That's a new panel. And uh, I went for a design that is pretty much the same as the MacDroid and all the 3D assets. I'm reusing some 3D assets from the shuttle here. Uh, that's from the big strawberry of level 2. And that's the general scheme of uh, industrial design. Um, rather factory design and um, the way it runs, the way it moves is uh, very similar to the rest of the machinery uh, very jerky tap hydraulic movements um, you can imagine there are motors and I think I'm gonna put some uh, uh, sound of motors um, it will go like that kind of stuff um, the difference here uh, is the way it scrolls. It's uh, very much like uh, something that, like an iPhone, an iPad. That's where the losing condition message appears, which is the same as what we had before. This handle, uh, if I have the time, I'll, I'll have them uh, movable uh, by clicking. It's pretty tempting, and that's uh, that's the score. We try call backup, same stuff, and uh, fold it back up. And if I win, same as before, I have none of that message. You you can see here it's uh, it's actually folded. If I grab this bit, let's see, lose score. I, no. If I move that stuff by hand, you see how it's um, how it's made. So that bit remains here. Um, it's tempting to have some kind of boxes here, but I'm going to keep it like that. This way it's not confusing, and when the snapshot goes into place, um, it'll uh, be framed pretty nicely. So it's made of elements from the shuttle here, the handle from the inside when the shuttle opens, and this is the scaffolding section that you can see in the, in the strawberry. So these are all 3D planes, uh, geometry. So it's very, very fast. I'm using NGUI, which is a, a really, really good package. So if I want to break, I do that. Boom! There you go. It's not read yet. Um, I'm working over a scene which doesn't contain any of the game logic, because the whole idea is that... Let's see. Boom. The whole idea is that uh, calls are made from the game logic to the UI and then the UI is sending back messages or delegates are being attached to the UI. Uh, this way they're completely decoupled and the way I present the data uh, is I can change it really easily without digging into uh, tens of thousands of lines of code. Mm. For instance, the stats is built very simply with a bunch of lists. And uh, and then the strings are concatenated before they are being displayed in the label. Um, it's pretty fast and allows to change the UI as the game uh, after the game is released. And add funny little things and little surprises. That's it. That's all for today. Thank you.